All right, day two of Oni Land. Chapter three. The terrible merry-go-round. Or the cursed merry-go-round, really. It'll be at least half as cursed as my stream. Abunai Norui no Merigorando. There, there. Everyone, please take a look. Well, that seems to be a carousel. Oh, so it's called a merry-go-round in this country. Now, now, don't get too excited in trip, Maria. Not that it'd be a problem since I would catch you anyway. And yes, just as you said, it is a merry-go-round. Hmm, how nice. I've never expected adults like us could come together and play with horses like this. It's pretty unlikely of us to play with things like these. Ah, but what about that gloomy man over there? You still bringing that long face of yours into an amusement park? I'm only here to obey your highness's order. Though I'm not used to it, I will ride one if I have to. I don't recall seeing such things back in our time. I heard they were invented in the 19th century, if I recall correctly. And also, it seems as though these were originated from France. And they seem to be utilizing modern electricity as their main source of energy. Ma! Ma! Talking about electricity, they were... Um... Mr. Edison and Nikola Tesla son's invention, right? Yes. Ma, ma, so this horse must be the same too. It's like a marriage between their invention and France. That's... Yes, I think that's very wonderful. I'm very proud of them. This collaboration between utilities made in France with the genius's wisdom. And we finally got its way to the countries of the East. It's so wonderful. I'm so delighted about this. Vive la France! <laughs> Since we're all here, let's all have some fun, shall we? Yes, your highness. Allow me to accompany you. Understood. So, Salieri, what are you going to do? I have no objections if that's what your highness wishes, but I'm not exactly Antonio Salieri, you see. I'm nothing but a mere part of Antonio Salieri that comprised of him. However, my respect towards your highness does still exist, and... Strangely, I do feel at peace in this land. Though it's not totally, I feel calmer than usual. But... Uh, you... You are a different story, Gottlieb Mozart! Kill! Kill, kill, kill! I'll kill you! You who was loved by God! Salieri-sensei, would it be too much of an inconvenience to join us for a ride? 
I'd be happy if you could just join us for a ride, you know. If that's your wish, your highness, then I will oblige. It seems as though I need to re... I'll need to recollect Antonio Salieri's remains of filth in the presence of God's pamperment. <laughs> How nice! That was a nice one indeed. But what's wrong, Maria? Don't glare at me like that. I'm not glaring, understand? And you should learn to be more honest with yourself. I know that you were really gentle deep down inside, so please try to get along, okay? Eh, but I'm trying my hardest now, though. I do love Salieri, after all. Well, oh, I'm not sure if I could be nicer. I'm not too confident in that kind of thing. Jeez, and this is why you're just... <laughs> They're so docile. I wonder what's happened to them. They're not even trying to run at all. So this is how electronics work. And then... They seem to only move in a monotonous pattern. It doesn't seem like they... Like they think like a new horse, huh? And since we can't even adjust their speed or anything, I guess it's fundamentally different from riding a horse. But still, this is pretty fun on its own. Right, Sensei? Well, not really for me. Like, why do they have to rotate while sporadically changing their altitude? They're supposed to be a children's toy, right? Come on, get a grip on yourself. A grand tactician such as you should be fine with one or two horses. Ah, but the physical sensation belongs not to the tactician inside of you, but you yourself, right? I do have some experience when it comes to riding horses, but... I hereby conclude that this riding of a horse and this are totally different stories. You said it yourself, didn't you? You feel sick? Sensei? Just a little. It's not a problem. <laughs> what is this? It feels so different from a horse and yet the same at the same time, Benkei. But I find it a little bit lacking. Don't you think so too? If you intend to mimic a horse, that's right, you have to be more aggressive in your vertical movements. That must not do, Lord Yoshitsune. You must not shake this. These toys don't seem to be designed to withstand Lord Yoshitsune's full strength, so please... Please do not play with your full strength. Go forth! Tell you Goro! Yoshitsune-sama, no! And why are you still in your summer outfit? You'll catch a cold... Wait a second. <laughs> so you've realized, Benkei, I've expected no less than from you. This actually has more cloth than my usual outfit. It's pretty warm. I see now. Exactly as my lord has said. This was very careless of me. We... We... <laughs> Boo Boo's having a good time. Onyland's first attraction, the merry-go-round, which is said to have 50 minutes of waiting per session, this seems to be very popular amongst the servants, Senpai. So there's 
still they still didn't have enough fun just from Hawaii, huh? I've scanned through the St. Graf's data. No mistake, all of those are called your servants. And not only that, it doesn't seem to be just them. All of the servants in Caldia, they're... They're disappearing one by one. Perhaps all of them are just simply heading here. I wonder if they've all forcefully passed it through by using their connections to... Gouda as a ray shift tunnel. <clears throat> they've all been summoned by Kamui's gold, it would seem. A mere holy grail that serves as a vessel for the accumulation of mana wouldn't be able to perform such a feat. But Kamui's gold is a different story. The gold not only attracts anyone that gazes upon it, but it also assembles everyone into one spot. Kamui's gold that's formed by mana would feast upon others in order to multiply itself. So you're saying that they're tr it's trying to absorb our mana. Yes, I think so. The scanning result has come in. That's exactly what's going on. Those tools within the merry-go-round. Although it's very subtle, they're actually absorbing servants' mana. So if we don't stop this, the Oni King's gonna get stronger? Exactly. We can't ignore it even if they're just even if it's just subtle. And besides, we have to retrieve the gold from the attraction manager too. Doji Dono, is there anything wrong? Uh, no. It's actually nothing. What's the matter? Um no. It just seems as if you were attracted by something. <laughs> That's not a very humorous joke you've got there, Shinobi. To put it in a human tongue, um, yes, stop speaking nonsense. Just look at those toys. They're jokes. It's just a ride that moves up and down. I'm not even paying any attention to it. Only, only a child would enjoy something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly... But, you know, if you really, 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 really urged me to, I wouldn't mind riding on it. Of course, only if you were to order me to. Whip Oni. Isn't that just fine? Why not just have a ride on it? Just go ahead and get on it. Isn't it normal to ride on whatever you desire? That's just nature, after all. Don't you think so? Nothing comes if you would meaninglessly hold yourself back. I am Mev. Queen Mev, the attraction manager of these horses. Ara? Hmm? And just when I thought I had saw some familiar faces, I wouldn't mind letting first comers ride for free, you know. Are you... Are you actually Caldia's Mev? Wait, but the data doesn't fit. The mana emanating from Mev's song feels closer to that of the parks than... Exactly! She's the merry-go-round's manager! It's just as Shita and I don't know has said. This menacing aura. <clears throat> hmm? What are you talking about? But yes, Caldia sure has a lot of adorable children around. Really? Really? I don't mind giving you some free service, but... I will have to punish any chil naughty children that are here to interfere with my merry-go-round. 
I call upon the Oni staff army. We have some troublesome visitors here. They might disturb our customers. They might disturb our customers. We have enemy readings. Senpai. If they decide to come at us with great numbers, we'd be out of options. I think that we should retreat for now, my, my lord. Wait a second. This isn't as many as before. Well, you were in the main street last time, so they appear indefinitely. But now that we're at just a single attraction spot, their power source is equal to the divided portion of the gold, so they can only summon below a designated amount of Oni. Hmm? Who's that kid? I've never seen her before. She's quite no she's quite annoying. Well, but not that I'd treat you any better just because I know you, you know. No matter how desperate you are, you do have to mind your manners. You have to be good looking and willing to wait until my work is finished, or else I wouldn't even entertain you, understand? And so... Let me give you just a few whips. Now take them all, graciously. Whip, whip. So come うちが全部綺麗に片付けたる<笑><笑> Does we know Alexander is a condor? Yeah. Yeah, he does. By the way, thank you very much, Sharpedo13, for the follow of who moons ago while we were reading. <laughs> ふふ。ふろでやる。いけず。あ、よし。無駄だ。せい。わなだ。<laughs> <laughs> え、<笑> Bye bye, Mev. Bye bye, Whip Oni. That's her name, Whip Oni. Or 
Prepare to be fisted! I got some popcorn. Wonder why she showed up as an assassin there. Really weird. As expected from the infamous Empress from a foreign land. She is strong. It seems like it's not going to be an easy task. The same goes to you. <laughs> I like hardworking women too, you know. But well, I suggest you to have a second thought on that extreme devotion. You're just killing yourself on the inside, you know. You should just ride the wave. Just like how you ride a horse. Just do as you please. Oh, and did you know, there's way more than one way to play with wooden horses. Like playing horses and playing horses and... And of course playing horses. But all you did was mention the same... Ah, Senpai! Be careful! Mevson's merry-go-round is... She's a... Uh, I don't know how to put this, but... She hugs them like her lovers and does an alluring dance with them and... Anyway, this isn't happy... This isn't healthy for Ibaraki-san, so Senpai, I, I suggest we ban everything in around your sight. You seriously do treat me like a child, don't you? Er, no, not that. Yeah. <clears throat> what the heck is up with this? I'd freak out if Shuten were to do that, but you? Don't make me laugh. If you want to eat the horses so badly, why don't you go ahead? Nobody's stopping you. Jeez. Yeah, she sure is hungry, huh? What? What other reason would there be for her to speak in such a manner? There's nothing else, right? She knows. <clears throat> just, just why are you dodging my eyes? Why is everyone averting their eyes from me? Why are you looking down? Raise your head and look at me. Or else I'll eat you. Damn it, why are you shaking your head? Hey, ninja... What the hell? Oh, oh dear, I never thought that you were such a beginner in such things. I've lost my interest now. Well then, in that case, let's just finish this up. Executive Oni. <laughs> Size won't matter here. It's a large type Oni, and there are multiple of them. So, she can summon large numbers of them, huh? That must mean that she's holding quite a large amount of the gold. And this won't be good. Mm. Mevalone is plenty enough already, and there are more powerful Oni coming at us. Ugh. Ora, how about I lend you a hand then? That voice, it can't be! Who? Yeah? Where did this stick come from? What the hell? Showing yourselves after speaking out your voice is just how presence concealment works, right? Now show yourself! Well, since you've put it that way, it'd be rude not to oblige, right? 
Oh yeah. Hehe, <laughs> pero. <clears throat> Goho Shoujo, arriving once more. Churros drop here. Churro time. You hear me, chat? It's churro time. Even if the heavens will forgive you, I guess I'm fine with it. Even if the world forgives you, then I guess that's it. Even if the people forgive you, well, not that it matters. But you see, it's only up to an Oni to decide if an Oni deserves what's coming to them. Hmm. Well, just do it however you wish to. I'll just look over you. I am Goho. Goho is I. Goho Shoujo has thus arrived once more. Yay! Chat, raise your hands to the sky and give the Goho Shoujo your power. Did she just say that stuff twice? Yep, mm hmm. Two times. Oh! Goho Shoujo Oni Cure! Never have I dreamed of seeing her twice. And important messages ought to be repeated for emphasis. That's just common sense. Ugh. What? Did, did you see that? Did you see that, Master? She winked at me. She definitely winked at me. Cuckoo. <laughs> I'm so pumped up now. I'm so excited. My blood's literally boiling and I can't hold it back any longer. I feel like I'm burning up. As expected, no less from the Oni of Law. Nothing else could manage to excite me like this until now. You're just as Shuten spoke of. Um... I'm not very sure if that wink is directed at Senpai or Ibaraki-san, but... Hmm, yeah, yeah, it doesn't really make a difference. Oni of Law, now that you're here, I take it that you're our ally. Would you mind if I expect so from you? As you say, I wonder. It's no fun if I were just to just simply say yes. Ain't that right? Enemies, allies, such a meaningless debate. <laughs> ma, ma, pochi. No need to be that mean. I'm Haku. Well, anyway... A mysterious Goho Shoujo just came and somehow is looking to trip... is joining a trip to look for the golden stuff. Let's just go ahead with that in mind. Got it. Oni or Oni, and should be free. 
Even when I am called the law, I am still an Oni. I might beat you down and melt you up, you know. So do bear with me, my sweet, sweet attraction manager. <laughs> Fine, bring it on then. Let's see just how far you can go. Allow me to show you the power of this attraction manager. No, of a gold servant. Brace yourself. Giant Onis are incoming. My lord! Initiate combat! ご奉仕女水産潰してまうけど堪忍なキラキラしてるまあオッケーそれそれ芸術とは考えたものさ。Pumpkin <笑> ogres. <笑> Oh, I forgot this guy spawns. No big deal. Yay, I hit them with an all terrain vehicle. <laughs> Ow. Okay. She's still an assassin. Well, that makes things uh, really easy now, doesn't it? How dare you abuse my cuties? Now you will die. Brutally. Ibaraki's back to eat cotton candy. Hona, 
最低くらいでとろかしてご褒少女くずりゅうおさちとつこくされちゃうハッハッハもう終わりか遊び足りぬわハッハッハッグジョブバウヌークス well She was rude. <sighs> not, not bad. I see, so this is what happens when the Oni of Law joins your side. No, I suppose it's more like straightforward, honest idiots. Care not about fortunes. Eh? Um. Senpai. There was no sign of retreat. Mevson has just vanished. Oops, uh, before you jump to conclusions, to clarify, that wasn't the Mev that we all know. It was a form manifested through a concentrated accumulation of mana by Kamui's gold, through forgery of our Caldia servant Saint Graf. Well, you could say it's a type of shadow servant, a servant's empty shell made out of the fragments of the gold. The real map should be alive and walking around just fine, no worries. Okay. Leave the rest to me. Gold. <sighs> Is that a distortion there? There's literally nothing there, though. An amount of mana enough to distort space. I wonder if that power belongs to the gold, my lord. It's supposed to be a proper gold. It's supposed to be proper gold in the form of a mineral, but you see, since the shell protecting its core is gone, what's left of it is an overflowing amount of mana from within. Give me a moment. Come here, come here. It must have been scary, right? Come here, come here. It's okay. This isn't your home, you see? I'll bring you back home, so don't be afraid. Come on, come here now. Welcome back. Our first, go our first gold has been retrieved, Senpai. Well then, I guess that's it. I guess I'll have to see y'all when the time comes. See you trash again. Ah! Again! Ooh. Oni Cure, Goho Shoujo. It looks like we couldn't talk again this time. But I have faith that we'll meet again someday. At least that's how I feel now. So did you guys see? Did you see? The Oni of Law's graceful performance. She saved me in the blink of an eye and then disappeared so coolly. Look at that graceful luring stance of hers. She really is just like Shuten. Uh, no comment. Senpai? Ah, I understand. Senpai, you don't want to destroy Ibaraki's on stream. So that's why, right? Huh? Or are you guys making a weird face? Well then, that appears to be our first achievement in our quest. Which brings us forward to our second gold. I wonder what kind of attraction manager awaits us. The second attraction is... 
the teacups. Ooh, teacups. The thing that goes round and round and round and round and round. The one that spins a lot. That one. <laughs> that Whipponey is among the weakest of the managers. Your efforts mean nothing. Moreover, they may have been mistaking just one thing. I am not an Ura. I am Shura. Yes, I am Oni King Shura. Ga ha 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 ha! Now go forth, my next attraction manager, the teacup manager. Show them the terror this spiral of matchmaking can bring upon. Ah, and remember to prepare some bags for them, though I find it entertaining to break couples within the cup. But I won't. But I don't desire to go so far as to fill it up with vomit. Oni may cry, as they say. Ha 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 ha! I love our villain of the week. Caution! The following scenes are voiced. Chowaskonu, nigai. Tokoro de Ibaraki. Soko ni dekai tea cup ga aru yaro. Oma, wale ga suwareru hodo oki. Masaka, shiburu no ka? Shiburu no ka? Gyu, gyu, gyu. Okay, so that little uh, aside, it was started with the Ibaraki going. I don't like tea. It's bitter. By the by the way, Ibaraki, you see that big teacup over there? Uma, that thing's big enough for me to sit inside. <gasps> Don't tell me. Are you going to tie me up inside of it? You? 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 Which is a sound effect of tying someone up. Yeah! Next episode. The end of the Northern Park. Oni Land. Turn and turn and turn. The Teacup of Terror. Be sure to enjoy it. Hooray! And that will be out tomorrow. We will be uh, doing more of that tomorrow. Meantime, it's farming time. Get your farm on, chat.